What's up, guys? Mud Turtle in here, bringing you uh, Call of Duty Kill Confirmed on Solar. And uh, in this gameplay, I'm going to be using the ASM1. Uh, and I'm going to talk a little bit about it. Obviously, it is probably the most overpowered weapon in Call of Duty. They did nerf it. But even so, it's still everyone's favorite. I, am, I assume, anyway. Everyone in the lobbies are always using them. And uh, for good reason, uh, it is a submachine gun class, uh, unlocked level 10, so you get it early on in the game. And as you can see, it just it just melts through people. It's it's ridiculous. And uh, right now, I'm using the uh, ASM1, just regular whatever you get when you start the game. I haven't gotten any of the elites yet. Uh, just haven't been fortunate enough. Um, but this gun just is amazing. So. Let's get to the stats on this gun. This gun does uh, damage a model of 17 to 35 hit points per bullet, fully automatic. Uh, magazine capacity is 45 rounds, 67 with extended mags. Um, total ammunition is going to be 135 with the regular clip and 203 with the extended mags. So you have ample uh, ammunition to do what you want to do. Let's talk about the range as well on this gun. You have a range of 11, which is pretty pretty damn good for a submachine gun class and accuracy. Uh, let's see, what's the accuracy on this thing? Actually, excuse me, range is a little 6 on this class and fire rate of 11, so it's pretty good fire rate. Uh, good damage model. You, you can't you can't go wrong with this with this weapon class. Uh, and in this in this game type, you don't really have to alter your your game style when you use this weapon. Uh, just because you you can get those intermediate shots, the long range shots. Uh, if you burst fire, if you just if you just time it correctly, you're gonna get the shot off and get multiple kills if you wanna if you wanna um, go for it or if you're fortunate enough. Uh, like these guys are just dropping perfectly in front of me and uh, I will note and this is I don't know a spoiler alert or not but basically I've, I've died three times in this round and unfortunately every time I die it's because of my own doing I die three times and all three times uh, yep on my own I probably should do a little bit better at my um, bombardments uh, placement and try to get out of the way because uh, I kill myself over and over and over. Well, I have, I don't know if I would have went on such a tear or not had I not killed myself, but at least, you know, give myself an opportunity. Look at that. Come on. That's ridiculous. So, uh, some of the variants on this class that you should hope for or, or shoot for is the Strider. It's a uh, tier level is elite. You get an extra plus one damage. You do lose accuracy, minus three, but you do gain uh, plus two range. Next, uh, on a lower level is the Rigor, uh, professional tier. Plus two accuracy, minus two handling. And then um, the last variant is the Reckless. Uh, it's a professional tier as well. Plus one fire rate, minus one handling. Uh, and then you have rapid fire attachment automatically on there. I don't, uh, I'm not one for rapid fire. I think this gun has uh, excellent uh, fire rate as it is. I don't think you need to include that, uh, that extra variant. I don't know if I would like that one. Uh, I wouldn't complain if I got it since they're so difficult to get. But um, it is, it is uh, something that maybe if you do enjoy that rapid fire, that would be something that you'd want to want to use. But yeah, guys, so basically, I don't use this weapon as often. Uh, every every prestige, I tend to switch up a gun, and I always find one that I, I typically enjoy more so than the other. And it's just like I don't know. Every prestige, I, I will find a weapon that I just really enjoy. Uh, I think last prestige it was a KF5. I may not be saying that right. Um, and that that gun was just so much fun to use. The last prestige, I was just using it all the time, getting so many kills with it, and it's been a lot of fun. And uh, I'm not sure. I just prestige recently. I'm not sure what I'm going to use this this time around a lot. Uh, I did use the ASM1 just because I was having a little bit of a funk uh, recently with the, the game plan. I'm like, you know what? Let's bust out this bad boy. I'm pretty sure I will be able to uh, get a good gameplay out of it. And sure enough, immediately upon 
um, equipping this weapon, uh, I just went beast mode. And number three, please don't bark. Please don't bark. Yep, there she goes. I was able to get a good uh, a good game right off the bat um, using this weapon. Uh, it's, it's one of my favorite weapons. Um, I try not to use it too often just because uh, it is overpowered, you know, and obviously everybody out there and their mother is going to be using the ASM one, uh, and for good reason, but I want to bring different varieties, different uh, weapon classes to, to this channel, uh, so that, you know, hell, let's just try something different. Uh, and I'm not sure, like, there's this one dude, uh, I didn't mean to punch there, I think that's a niche move, I didn't mean to punch, but there's this one guy, apparently in this level, who is content with just going around in circles and um, firing up in the air for whatever reason and those are free points I'm not gonna pass that up at all yes, props to me I didn't kill myself first time there he is again uh, first time I didn't uh, kill myself with uh, with the bomb strike and that's a really good spot I did not know that you can perch up on that that spot definitely a, something to remember for kill com not kill com for search and destroy later on there's definitely some good campy spots on this level uh, to look out for that'd be a great spot if you um, you know if you're trying to get ahead of people uh, definitely a good spot there's also right in the beginning uh, I'm not near it but there's another good spot I'll have to show you guys later if you're not familiar with it uh, but that's gonna wrap up this gameplay guys I hope you enjoyed I did play with Nakajua Kingpin and Yosoi Jack Bauer it was fun and uh, actually final kill uh, count is 39 and 3 which uh, is not bad, uh, if I don't say so myself. So uh, until next time, guys, uh, this is uh, Mud Turlin. I'll see you guys later.